I don't know what it is about this that I'm looking at, but it's making me a little uncomfortable. Let's go ahead and let's, we'll, we'll close that. TPRR just released a pretty big update that includes all the brand new FNAF movie animatronics, plus a ton of brand new old man consequences animatronics as well. In this video, we're just going to be checking out the movie or the cinematic universe animatronics. So that's Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, Foxy, Golden Freddy, and Spring Bonnie. In the video tomorrow, we will be checking out all the old man consequences characters. So if you want to see them, stick around for tomorrow. So of course here, we got Freddy Fazbear himself. We have an attack. Oh my God. We also have a buy bite GUI prompt. What is, oh my God, I bit his head off. Matt Pat, no. We can pick the eyes as well. We can have the yellow eyes, looks like a lizard. We have the red eyes, of course, black eyes, and the normal unsuited. And we can toggle the microphone which you gotta have. And then for animations and sounds, they all are, or at least for animations, they are the basic ones, it looks like. Who are you looking at? And then for sounds, classic Freddy Fazbear sounds, of course, because you gotta. Also, just look at the difference. This is the cinematic universe, Freddy. This is the normal Freddy. Look at how different they are. That's crazy looking. The cinematic universe, Freddy, looks so much better. Is that just me? Well, anyway, all the animatronics, or at least the first three are 800 coins. Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, all 800. Foxy is 900. Then Golden Freddy and Spring Bonnie get a little bit more expensive. So let's go ahead and just buy everybody now. If you need coins or tickets, make sure you are doing the daily tasks and make sure you try to get all the achievements you can in game so you get all the currency possible. Also, don't forget to talk to Gift Bear and get your free gift, whatever it might be. Here's Bonnie. Look at him. We could drink a cola. I do wish they added a FNAF movie map to the game. I'm assuming they're going to eventually, uh, but maybe not this update, unless I missed it. I don't think I did, but you never know. So Bonnie also has an attack, his little electric thing. We could play the guitar. Uh, I probably should have pulled out the guitar first. That looks a little weird. We can change his eyes as well. And, of course, we can pull out the guitar. There we go. That does look a little bit better. All right, enough. Bonnie, enough. Bonnie, enough. We can also change his eyes to red, to black, and, of course, the normal, the Bonnie red. Look at the detail on this suit. Oh, my God. These suits look fantastic. Also, having them sprint at you like this is pretty funny. It just looks very goofy. Now, of course, we have Chica and Cupcake. We have an attack again. Companion mode. Well, I gotta buy companion mode. Transform, hop off as Cupcake. Oh my God, I'm Cupcake. What is that sound? What is he doing? Toggle AI. Chica, follow me. That is such a cool feature. The companion mode is such a good idea in this game. Oh, wait, can I? Oh, uh, I thought I could hop on. I could kind of hop on the plate. Kind of. Not not really, but kind of, sort of. So for a cupcake, we do have a punch, an ankle bite, it's called. And of course, we can remount cupcake. Oh, back on the plate. I guess that makes sense. But wait, cupcake. Oh, Chica, I'm sorry. Chica, get up. Chica, get up. All right, we're good. Cupcake does have some sounds and a scream. That's what a cupcake sounds like. Oh my God, his eyes. What are his eyes doing? Oh, what's, oh my God. He's looking awfully suspicious, this cupcake. Let's go ahead and remount him on Chica. Chica, what was that? Chica was trying to walk like cupcake. I don't know, that looked really weird. Uh, Chica also has the different color. Oh wait, oh, you could get rid of cupcake. Oh no, you gotta have Cupcake out. And now we can change Chica's eyes to yellow, red, and black. And then for animations, we have a performance. Oh, look at her go, she's moving. She's doing a little groove, a little boogie. We have a window pose as well for her. Oh my God, why is she shaking like that? She's mad, she's freaking out. And then it first sounds a groan, a kitchen, and a scream. Next up is Foxy, the teleporting animatronic. 
He doesn't run down holes anymore. He teleports. So for Foxy, oh my God, look at the detail. Oh, what's he, what's he, what's he thinking about? He's thinking about something. Uh, we have an attack, of course. We have a sprint. There it is. Classic Foxy sprint, my favorite. And then you can just sprint normally, but it doesn't look as cool if you don't hit the button. There we go. Oh my God, he's so fast. He's so fast. And of course we can change his eye color as well. Oh my God, that's so great. We can change it to red. Oh, oh. interesting idle animation for Foxy. He's going a little bit crazy. Is that duct tape? How long has that been duct tape? I mean, I guess, I don't know how else he'd hold the eye patch in place. That's really interesting. I never noticed that. Is it like that in the movie too? If so, that's an insane attention to detail. But then for Fox's animations, we have the unhinged camera pose. That is pretty unhinged. We have a performance. We have eye patch up and hook raise. Look at that. Look at him go. Look at classic Fox. Look at him crawl. It's gotta be so hard crawling with the hook hand. Poor Foxy. Then for sounds, banging, singing, and a scream. What a weird animatronic this guy is. It's Sans Golden Freddy time. Sans Golden Freddy, one of the coolest animatronics from the movie, in my opinion. Him and Spring Bonnie are definitely really cool designs. Uh, we have an attack. We have replace part toggle eye. Oh no, you gotta have the Sans eye. We have a phase. Oh, he's gone. Oh, there he is. We also have a companion mode as well. Let's see what that is. Oh, it's me. I was the ghost child inside Golden Freddy the whole time even. And then I could transform. Oh my God. And then I can, uh, oh my God, my head is huge. I can transform again. I can uh, revert to Avatar. Oh my God. Uh, how do I go back? I don't think I can go back. Also, is this Mike's sister? Is this Abby? Spoiler, I guess. Whoop, there we go. We're back to Golden Freddy. We have a kill screen for 10 tickets. Uh, but first, before he kills us, we have a glitchy reach. We have a spring lock sit and a couple other basic animations for a Golden Freddy performance. Oh, look at him. He's having a good time. It's a shame there's no taxi. I can't get in the taxi as an animation with Golden Freddy. Maybe next time. And then for sounds, the <laughs> laugh, the voice, ambience, and a scream. That's, uh, that's going on for a while, huh? Last but not least, we have Spring Bonnie from the movie. This suit's detail is crazy. It's got all the, the mold, I guess that is. Even the, the mask itself is so cool. The way the teeth, like, the way the mouth is all decayed away there. Very, very nice. For Spring Bonnie, we have the face plates. Oh my God. That is very weird. I don't know what it is about this that I'm looking at, but it's making me a little uncomfortable. Let's go ahead and just, we'll, we'll close that. We'll, we'll, we'll close the mask. We can toggle the knife. We can punch. Oh my God, we threw the knife. Oh my, does that actually kill? Uh, we can exit the spring lock as well. It was me. I was William Afton the whole, I mean, I can change the face, but it doesn't really matter considering you can't see it. That is a little, oh, oh my God. His smile is so creepy. What's wrong with this guy? Uh, how do I go back? Uh-oh. Steve, Steve Raglan. There he is. And then we could go back to the cinematic Spring Bonnie here. What's the difference? You could be cinematic William Afton or Steve Raglan. What's the difference between these two? I, uh, I don't see a difference. Also, another spoiler, I guess. But, I mean, if you're watching a video about the movie, you should have already seen the movie, you know. That's not my fault. Steve is possessed. And then for Bonnie sounds, we have a walk, a mascot laughter, and a scream. And animations, a backstab. Oh, I should probably have the knife. There we go. Oh my God, it's so brutal. Stop. A stab barrage. 
What is wrong with this guy? This guy's a freak. We have a spring deactivate, a performance, a spring twitch, twitch spring sit, crawl, crawl, Steve. And we can look up and left and right. Actually, I lied. That wasn't the last character because there's new humans as well. So for, I think this is the one that was in that training video that Mike watched in the beginning. Uh, oh my God, it was actually me, I'm sorry. Who can this transform into? Oh, we have casual clothes for him too? Oh my God. Not every human that was in the movie is in the game. We do have Mike, his sister, Abby. We have a cinematic Vanessa. And then of course, William Afton and Kim. Yeah, she's the guide for the employee introduction video. That is Kim. So let's go to Mike Schmidt. Also a spoiler, I guess, if you didn't know his last name. Oh my God. His eyes look, he looks like a ghost or something. Spoiler, whoops. So for Mike, we could turn him into yourself and we could put him in some casual clothes. He still, <laughs> he still doesn't look like he's having a good time. Where's the sleep animation? There's gotta be a sleep. Well, I guess that's, oh wait, we can, there we go. Now it's like we're watching the FNAF movie because it's just Mike sleeping. <laughs> and of course we have the interesting Vanessa that threatened to shoot Mike. Uh, uh what, what kind of gun is this? Oh my god, it's a taser. Oh my god. There's the gun. Look at her smiling like that. Very nice. Uh, I don't know what... Wait, what? You could just put up caution tape? That's crazy. That's so cool. Has that always been a thing or is that new to this character? Also, this taser is pretty sick. But with Vanessa, we can revert to our avatar. We can transform into casual clothes and we can pick the face. We can make her angry. We can make her happy or we can make her default. And now those are all the brand new characters in the game. So if you enjoyed this video, leave a like and comment down below. Subscribe if you're not already. And make sure you don't miss tomorrow's video where we go check out all the brand new old man consequences characters. Some of them are very interesting. So you're not gonna wanna miss tomorrow's video. I'll see you then. Bye.